you want to say what the heck is up? Like to climb, billboard, ad, install. <laughs> okay, this is the That's third, the third time. time someone mentioned that. <laughs> That's uh, reaching uh, Austin. Like the one so can you hold that apple with just your mouth? No hands. Our pants fell off. It's another windy day in Austin. Can you help me? <laughs> Can you help me? Okay, time for some updates. It is literally so cold out there. I think it's like 40 degrees or like, last time we checked it was like 39 degrees and it's so windy. So I'm actually in the truck right now eating my thermos lunch that I packed this morning. <laughs> Currently defrosting and eating my lunch and it's so funny because I'm in this car and it's not on and I'm just in here eating my lunch like shivering. <laughs> oh my god, it's so cold out there. We're kind of running into the same issue we had last time we were in Austin which was that it was super windy and we ended up not using our tarp. Hold on, there's people coming by. I gotta pretend like I'm just eating. Anywho, at the beginning of the market, we were trying to keep our tarp up, but it was like just sketching us out too bad. It was giving me too much anxiety. So we took the tarp off, feel a little bit better now. Compared to the last ISG market that we did, which was bright and sunny and like literally the most beautiful day ever, the vibes are kind of down for the beginning of this market just because everyone's so cold and like, I don't even know how many people are gonna show up because it's so cold. My skin's literally falling apart. I've had this scarf wrapped around like my mouth and my nose. So the scarf is like peeling my skin away and ugh, I'm just like so itchy everywhere because I have so many layers of stuff on. I'm just trying to keep a positive attitude and we're just kind of laughing through our pain. Our rack fell over twice. Whatever, we just fixed it. We'll see how the rest of today goes. I haven't been filming that much because I literally don't want to take my hands out of my pockets. It's just so damn cold and windy. Ugh. Morning. Good morning. We are back at the Guad Vintage Market, <laughs> and it's not oh, windy that. today. How amazing is that? I mean, there's some wind, but it's not as windy as it was last time. So that is perfect and beautiful, and the skies are blue. Oh, look and at this. We're gonna video this. hold on. Oh, 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 get it. Get, go get it. Oh. Go. Oh. <laughs> some things shifted around in the U-Haul. That's okay. Y'all look like an album cover right now. <laughs> like so much like an album cover, it's not even funny. <laughs> All right, it is a few days later. I kind of just want to do a rundown of both of the markets because I really did not get as much footage as I thought I did. Like I thought I was filming a lot, but I literally only had like five minutes of usable footage. So I was like, what the hell? I remember filming so much, but I guess like not a lot of it was that great. So, anywho, I want to do a little rundown of both of the markets. Luna, if I can hear you licking yourself in the background. So, the ISG Studios market on Saturday was 
kind of like really anxiety inducing in the beginning. <laughs> there were tents flying, just like at our last Austin market weekend. It was just the wind was kicking everyone's butts in the morning. And we had our tent cover up in the beginning. And then we decided that we were just too nervous about it and we wanted to take it off. And then we didn't want to take the whole tent down to take it off. So we started like ripping it off while the tent was up. And then the wind started blowing. So when it was like halfway undone, it started, the wind started like trying to take the tarp away. And we were like holding on for dear life. And it was so loud and everyone was looking at us. And it was like, so just like annoying the whole situation. But we got the tent cover off. And after that, it was pretty chill because the tent just stopped like moving so much. I wasn't worried about it like popping out of place or anything. So that didn't seem to affect like the outcome of the market too much. We actually did pretty good that day. We did better the first time we did ISG, which was like back in September, I think. But that was a much warmer day. And considering the weather we had to work with, I'm not mad at our outcome because it was really, really cold and really, really windy. And I was honestly surprised at the amount of people that showed up. And then on Sunday, we were much more confident about the weather that day. There was like no strong winds, it was blue skies. It was actually like really comfortable weather most of the day. It kind of got cold a little bit towards the end, but we actually did pretty well that day. I was really happy with our sales and it was just a fun vibe. We were just hanging with our friends and you know, talking to people. The Austin Marathon was going on that day. I put a little clip of it. And honestly, watching those people run the marathon suddenly made me think that I can run a marathon. Maybe not a full marathon, but like a half one. And now I kind of want to start training for one. <laughs> Which is like, I don't know if I could do that. Every time I run a mile, I get massive shin splints. So this is off topic, but that was a big uh, development in my mind that day was me being like, I'm gonna train to run a marathon. So yeah, um, it was overall very, very fun weekend. Luna, you're literally so loud. My cat's giving herself a bath right now and it's like the loudest thing in the world. So anyways. I just like giving y'all little glimpses of like what it's like from our end when we go to sell at these markets. I literally have no idea what my next video is going to be. I actually do know what the next video is going to be. I'm literally lying. We are about to start prepping for ThriftCon Atlanta, which is coming up March 22nd and 23rd. ThriftCon has decided to do two day events. We're going to see how that goes. I'm sure it's going to be literally so exhausting. <laughs> yeah, I'm very excited about that. See how all of that turns out. and I I will be making prep videos and of course I'll do a vlog of the event itself. Fingers crossed everything goes smoothly and I will take you guys along for that journey. <laughs> Make sure to follow us on Instagram at neomy.vintage and shop with us online at neomyvintage.com if you want to check out what kind of things we sell in online or catch us at a market in Houston or Austin or possibly Dallas. You'll see what market we're going to be at on our Instagram. Have a wonderful beautiful day and I will see you in the next one. Next one.